Hello, beautiful people. How are we doing today? Good night, good morning, good evening, whatever time you're listening. What's good in your hood? Uh, I am Yai Joyce and welcome to day 16 of self-coaching and self-reflection, having radical honesty for our soul so we can start our year off 2022 in absolute truth and absolute greatness. I help my clients in toxic habits, grow their joy, transform their business, improve their lives, wealth and well-restedness. I do that through a combination of unique coaching methods of ancestral healing, astrology, and spiritual psychological coaching and counseling. And if you would like to know how I can help you grow that joy, wealth and well-restedness, yayudrace.com to book your spiritual strategy session or your one-on-one coaching with me to get your ish to Gather. If this has blessed you and filled your life with joy and grace and you want to donate, you can donate to the Patreon, patreon.com slash Hulu Healing. You can donate more than the $8 if you see so fit. And you can also donate to me directly at Cash App, um, dollar sign, Living Joyful. And so today's message of radical honesty for our souls is asking us to embrace that the human body um, the human being is a is composed of body and soul. All of our affairs and activities contain elements of both body and soul, the material and the spiritual. Even though our um, mundane and our routine activities are gen are you know usually motivated by um, just material, right? This is material and our physical gain. We tend to forget that our soul is within all of those mundane things that we do. All of the mundane things that we do, that is a privilege, that it's an honor to do, that our souls call out to recognize. What is it that is ordinary? That if you really took the time to think about it, it's not ordinary, it's actually extraordinary. We say we live in deep gratitude, but many times we don't. What are some of the ordinary things that you get to do that's actually extraordinary? Driving in your car, sitting in traffic is absolutely extraordinary. That you can get up and get into a moving thing to get you from point A to point B. What is the ordinary affairs that if we put more awareness and looked at them from a higher purpose and looked at them from body soul perspective, what are some ordinary things that you complain about that when you really look at it, it's extraordinary? Each one of us is a piece of all creation. The achievements that we make on earth are a harmony between the heaven and the earth within us. The technology advances, all that. It's just the, it's just the extraordinary God in us. When we look at things more with spiritual eyes, how can you go about blessing your daily activity more and seeing the body and the soul of it, in the mundane, in your ordinary, how can you start to view things more as it is harmony between heaven and earth? So look at the ordinary things in your life today and how can you actually view your mundane as extraordinary gifts? I pray that this has blessed you and filled your life with absolute joy and absolute grace and that you have a radical, honest moment with your soul today. Live well, live in ultimate divine joy. If you need me, you know where to find me, yayjoyce.com, Y-A-Y-I-J-O-Y-C-E.com. Beautiful people.